I'm good. Well, we are here. My name is Dara, and we are here at Ramajama Christmas in Chicago. I'm with the incomparable Paul Campbell, Tyler Hines. Thank you so much. Now, Paul, this is your first Rama drama. How are you feeling tonight? Uh, I feel like a million bucks. Not As you lie. should. This is, a, this is an extraordinary event. This has exceeded my expectations. Everybody looks incredible. The event space is incredible. This is truly a night to remember. Now, Tyler, you're no, you're no stranger to Rama drama. This is your third Rama drama, I believe. How are you feeling with it being Christmas time this time? I feel good. I feel like it, like the way Paul looks, which is a million bucks. Look at him. Look at my boy. Look at him. You gotta dress to impress, you it's know? Impressive. Truly. Now, I don't know if you guys heard, but your movie made number one in America for 20 and 22. How does that make you feel? Very proud. I, th I think, you know, like we started this thing, Paul started this thing with Kimberly Susted, who wrote it. And the fact that we've gone through all this together as friends uh, has truly been a spectacular thing. And, and I think uh, the fact that people watched it and supported it as they did, honestly, we're obviously very, very grateful for it. Yeah, I think we, th just the fact that we got to make this movie with full support of the network and spend three weeks being silly with our friends and telling stories we wanted to tell was really so extraordinary in and of itself and then for people to respond the way that they did uh, is sort of the icing on the cake but yeah I think we're we're honored and surprised and flattered by all of it. Now you mentioned be being silly with your friends what was your favorite part of the filming process? Honestly I have not laughed as much during filming ever maybe in my entire life. These boys just, I, I was by far the least professional, but trying to keep it together. On many levels. Well, we don't need to go into all of them right now. Um, we are on camera. But uh, the, Tyler, in particular, making me break so many times. Like, I ruined so many takes because I could not stop laughing. It was you. You were the one who broke the most out of it. Like, 90%. 90% was me just delighted at what nonsense these guys were bringing. Yeah, truly. Tyler, anything you wanted to add about your favorite part of the filming process? I mean, just being with two people that I greatly admire and love very much, Paul and Andrew are like my closest friends and, and, uh, and so talented. It's to see them do their thing up close in these scenes is like a gift that is a rare moment where you get to spend these kinds of uh, days together doing what we do. So yeah, it was, it was that. Now your movie already aired, but you're going to have a chance to watch it while your fans watch it. How are you feeling about that? I'm really excited because we have so much additional content and so many stories to share about what went into the making of this film that it'll be a completely different experience. And to be able to laugh hopefully along with people as they watch the movie and really let them in on what the filmmaking experience was like for us is is something you don't ever get to do this is i'm really excited about this tyler what about you i forgot the question i was making <laughs> eye contact with maureen over here oh, right. <laughs> i was asking so you you have a chance now to watch three wise men and a baby yeah. with your fans so what is that like what are you looking forward to with that i've been waiting for this moment i i watched the movie uh an earlier cut of it before uh, Drew and Paul had a chance to. And since that day, I've been quietly waiting for this moment to, to see their reaction, and specifically Paul's, because he's you know really built this thing from the ground up. So to see him get the reaction in real time from everybody who's enjoyed his work and, and our work is going to be a privilege. I can't wait. I love that. Now, we are at Rama Drama Christmas in Chicago, so I wanted to ask a Christmas-related question. What's your favorite part of the Christmas season? What makes it special for you? Oh man! Well, I have a I have a six-year-old son, and his joy, his wonder, and his his sort of the mystique of Christmas and the magic of Christmas. This is like the perfect age for a child to be experiencing Christmas. So just watching him, you know, uh, discover the joy that I remember having when I was a kid. <laughs> That I lost in my twenties, and then <laughs> you, it's all you gone now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, just just uh, seeing Christmas again through his eyes, truly.
He's cold and dead inside. Yeah. 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 That makes a lot of sense. No, I'm just kidding. But um, Tyler, what's special what? for you? <laughs> what's special for you about the Christmas season? Uh, this year specifically, there's a tradition that I had started with my close family and friends, and Paul will now be a part of, which he doesn't know. I brought you a boot, by the way. You did? Yeah, I did, yeah. Um, I don't even know about this tradition. I don't, I don't know, know what the thing is. Well, you're going to hear it right now. So okay. we started a tradition uh, a few years ago. Friends and family get a little glass that's like shaped like a boot. You take a shot out of it. You hang it on your tree. You send a photo of yourself taking that shot to your little group of friends and family who's in this little okay. sort of like cis little squad that you've built. Okay. And so you'll be a part of my squad. But this year... Um, I'd made some for, for folks who wanted this boot, and they've been sharing it with each other, and uh, just hearing their stories about giving the boot away and starting this tradition with, within their sort of family and friends has been uh, an emotional uh, satisfaction I didn't see coming. I, I, I knew I would enjoy it, but it's uh, overwhelming how beautiful the whole thing is, and you're going to join the family, too. That's really fantastic. Thanks, Bob. Well, thank you guys so much for talking with me. It's been a pleasure. Thank Enjoy you. your time tonight, and happy holidays to you. We thank will. you guys. Thank you. You're too good at this.